Hey, what's going on? It's Bauer. You're looking at the new Nikon Coolpix P6000. Highly anticipated little camera, uh, and it's incredibly powerful, and it's very cool, and it takes amazing pictures, and it's going to give you uh, the ability to do stuff you've never been able to do on a digital camera before, uh, in, mo in all likelihood. Uh, it's got 13.5 megapixels to start off with, so right out of the gate, it's already got an extraordinarily high resolution uh, on this sensor here, 13.5 megapixels. It does 4X digital, 4X optical as well, of course, the optical being the more important of the two. Uh, it does do GPS geotagging. Now, if you look at the side here, you can see it does have a GPS antenna that is built into the camera. So, when you're taking pictures, uh, this will actually embed the latitude and longitude of wherever you take your photographs into the data in the picture. Uh, then, when you upload the photo somewhere like Flickr or, uh, or you're browsing photos in, uh, in one of your photo management programs, you'll be able to browse your pictures by location or look at exactly where your pictures were taken on Flickr on a, on a Google map. Uh, it's incredibly powerful and very, very cool. Um, it has the, the, the Nikkor glass lens, so you're going to get really, really sharp very clear photos with this camera. It's got a 2.7 inch LCD on the back of it and it's a, a very very sharp looking LCD display on this camera. Uh, it does have optical stabilization built into it uh, so it doesn't use the the digital stabilization that you see uh, on a lot of cameras. This actually will use the optical stabilization scheme to make sure your shaky hands don't ruin your photographs. Um, it does have, uh, it, you can actually add attachments to this lens. So there are wide angle and telephoto converters for this camera. You simply pop this ring off and they are available for you to add to this camera. So you, you can expand it uh, a little bit uh, rather than being locked into only the, the lens setup that you have on the camera right now. It also does really low, uh, really good in low light situations. Uh, it gets up to 6400 ISO on this camera. So uh, it performs extraordinarily well when there's not a whole hell of a lot of light in the room. So let's go ahead and take a look at how this thing works a little bit. It's got a lot of buttons, a lot of wheels, a lot going on uh, because it gives you a lot of ability uh, to to customize your photos and, and, and tweak them manually. If you take a look here, this is your, uh, this is your of course, your wheel. Uh, this is where you can get to all of your quick functions. Uh, this is also a navigation wheel right here. Uh, your manual and telephoto zoom settings are located right here, and your shutter is going to be right here. On the side is where the GPS antenna for this camera is located, and that's going to allow you to do all those GPS geotagging features. On the bottom, now this does take SD cards, so uh, you won't have to worry about uh, any kind of crazy storage card on this. It does take SD. It also has a rechargeable battery and comes with that rechargeable battery. Uh, it also has something going